hello once again and this is the continuation of the 17 email income acts you see if you have not watched the beginning of all these hacks i really want you to really go and watch them they are about 17 hacks in number and today i'll be talking about a hack number 15 i've spoken about hack number one which is the survey hack number two which is the hero hack number three which is the broadcast hack number four which is the mirror hack radical hack um the lack of three hack the a lot of card the preframe hack the premium hack quite a lot of hacks that i've shared down there uh, in my previous video these hacks are very effective you see the reason why a lot of people are not really generating income from their email list is because they are not making use of some certain tactics professional email marketers are using out there to to generate a lot of income and immediately i started using all these hacks I've seen an increase in my income through via email via sending email out you see people do tell you that the money is in the list yes it is true the money is in the list but it is it doesn't just happen like that there are some tactics you need to make use of you need to use for you to get invoke that action to make people to click on the link you're sending to them in your email so that that could lead into you generating sales if it's sales you invoking action on whatever you want them to do so with that being said i'll be talking about what we call the real person hack today you see the real person hack is so simple but a lot of people do not make use of this hack you see, the real person hack is probably not what you think about. You see, I think a lot of people do not do this because of laziness. And I'm telling you, you are missing out on real people. You see, it's all like, not all about you getting that people in your email list. You are missing out on real people that are on your list that are getting your emails from you. And the people that aren't actually real are getting emails from you. See, the real people not getting emails from you are not getting them because you are not using this hack. You see, this hack is so simple, but a lot of people do not know that it really, really exists. And that is, they just start crying that, why am I not getting um, any form of my email being opened no click through it on my my click through it on my email is gone down it's because of this hack you see people do not know it that's why i call it the real person hack you see a lot of time it is because sometimes it could be overwhelmed it could be uh, it may be because you need to tell someone else to do this for you it may be because you need to tell someone in your office to handle this for you or someone who is your who is in charge of your email marketing to start handling this for you so what i really want to tell you about is really about your email list you see your subscriber people who subscribe to you people who subscribe to you that they, they've gone through your email list tend to use what we call the spam arrest. You see, there are some people today, they make use of what we call spam arrest. They give you their email, yes, fine, but they have what we call spam ar arrest in their own email. What that means is that when you send an email to a person that has a spam arrest in their email, your email go doesn't go in. It comes back to you, requesting you to verify by inputting certain words before your email now goes through to that person's inbox. That's why you really need, and these are real people, you understand? And that's why a lot of people find these days that their email 
does not get delivered. And when you look at it, this sperm arrest is um something much of like this. You see, it, I want you to go just type in on Google sperm arrest, and you'll be able to know get full you get to know about what this company does. You see, they take control of people's inbox. People do apply to them. You see, it's all about preventing spam from people. A lot of people now, they make use of spam arrest, especially when you are getting new subscriber. You will get this. We get this all day long. We get a lot of subscriber coming in and I have someone myself who manually goes in there, get spam verified senders. You see, there are some people who are, they need, they need you to verify before their email, your email goes through to them. So people are protecting themselves from junk email these days. And so we click on the link. So I get someone to click on those links and verify those people, verify that I am the sender before my so that my email can go drop into the inbox of those people that are, are that has the spam arrest alert on their email box. We go to it and now what they will do, what they will do basically is request a sender verify themselves before their email is delivered. You see, what this spam array does is that you need, they, they, they send it that you need to verify yourself before you your email is delivered into the person's inbox. A lot of marketers do not know that this is available. People are using this, this, this. Let me tell you, if you have seen your deliver deliverability of your email gone down, You've seen nothing, no open rates on your email that you're sending, no click-through rates. It's because people are now making use of what we call spam arrest. So this is a little hack a lot of people do not know. So, but what I really want you to do right now, whenever you're sending an email out, try to go and check whether there is any form of spam, uh, whether there is form of sender verify, a, a, a request from sender verify through spam arrest before they want you to verify yourself before your email drops through. This is quite annoying, especially where you have <laughs> about 100,000 people in your email list. So this is when you need to get someone. You might need to hire a VA to do this for you. You might need to hire someone or recruit someone to get this done for you. But let me tell you, once you get this done, you see there will be an input increase in your click rate because now you know these are real people. They are guarding their email from any form of junk mail. But once you can go there and verify yourself that you are not junk, your email goes smoothly through and drops into these people's inbox. And they will be a, these people will be able to read the email you're sending to them. And also you'll be able to invoke any form of action, whatever steps you want them to take through reading your email. So I hope every you get this little hack. This hack, a lot of people do not even know that it really exists. And I have been making use of it, and it should be really, in fact, it came to a surprise. I was really surprised that such thing is really, there is some, such a company called Spam Arrest, and a lot of people are making use of Spam Arrest in their email because they are trying to avoid any form of junk email. You see, people are bombarded, bombarded with emails these days that they had to look for an alternative way to make sure all these emails are going not even coming in rather than going into their junk email those emails will not even come in at all so with that being said i hope this really helps if you've not watched my previous videos i really want you to go and watch them these hacks i'm sharing are really very effective and i guarantee that you will see a difference when you start using it in your email list so with that being said if this is something of interest to you i still have two more hacks to share 
click on the subscribe button and the notification bell so that you get notified whenever i share the rest of the hacks and if you think this has been helpful to you give it a thumbs up and with that being said i will see you on my next hack video email income video bye